Explosions here on the water, flames ripping through a large boat in Marina del Rey, fireworks shooting into the harbor. And we have a crew live on the ground, Sky Cal live overhead, and assignment editor Mike Rogers live at the desk. Mike, what can you tell us? Yeah, Pat and Chauncey, this fire burned for quite some time. Lots of flames. We got lots of calls, viewers sending in videos like the one you see behind me here. But I want to take you to more video here of all of this going down. And you can see LA County Fire Department struggling because there are fireworks that are shooting out of this boat. We also hear up to a thousand rounds of ammunition were on the boat as well. So that certainly gave firefighters something to contend with. They this both from the ground and the water, bringing out a couple of their fireboats. You can see the flames shooting out. You can hear the explosions in the video here. Now, there were two people on board, we were told by LA County Fire Department. They were able to safely get off of the boat, but this boat burned for so long and created so much damage. I want to show you what happened. Eventually, the boat sank. Our cameras were there and rolling when this happened, and you can see the boat listed to one side and then rather quickly just became fully submerged in in water. I want to take you uh, to SkyCal that is live overhead right now. That is what the boat looks like on its side. Our Desmond Shaw live in SkyCal. Des, now they're conducting what's called a booming operation, right? That is correct. I'll widen out and show you here. They uh, got this out here very quickly. I'll highlight it for you here. This big yellow thing going across right here that they put in the harbor in this inlet to try to prevent uh, all of that oil and motor fuel from uh, getting into the wider harbor. So you can see as well, it's also corralling a lot of the foam that they were spraying uh, on the boat itself. You know, the boat was already going to be a total loss. Now it's really going to be complicated to get out of here. They're going to be getting a, a salvage operation in here. Might not happen until tomorrow morning, but then it's going to be pretty complicated on how they're going to upright this boat and then how to get it out of there. That's going to be up to the harbor master, but you can see uh, it looks like uh, maybe sheriff's deputies and L.A. County Fire here uh, assessing the uh, scene. So very, very tough night for the owners of that boat, but at least we didn't hear about any injuries. Mike, back to you. Yeah, Desmond, thank you. It's a 100-foot long boat. I want to show you one more set of live pictures here from the ground. This is where our photographer watched the boat sink. When we first saw these live pictures, you actually saw the boat. Now, as you can see, you don't see it because it is totally on its side. Pat and Chauncey, uh, L.A. County Fire Department says this was a very delicate balance of figuring out how much foam and water to spray at the boat because obviously if they put water on it that makes the boat be heavy they were concerned about it sinking and unfortunately that's exactly what happened all right mike thank you